you worthless slug! <laughs> Not that I don't enjoy bringing you to justice time and again, Dr. Black. But aren't you tired of getting beat? Extremely. Which is why I lured you here. Think you're finally gonna beat me in a duel? <laughs> I know I am. Settle down, Burpee. You'll get your chance. So, are you gonna tell me what this is all about? Or do I have to guess? I'll do one better, Will Shane. I'll show you. Is that a slug? Black, what have you done to it? <laughs> I fixed it. Made it better. Good enough to finally beat you. The power! I could never imagine! You have no idea what you're doing! Corrupting slugs! You can destroy all slug terra! Black! Stop this! You have to stop it! Black! Black! Find my son. Find Eli. Give him the letter. Go! <laughs> What are you doing here? It's Dad, isn't it? <laughs> Dear Eli, if you're reading this, it means I've fallen protecting Slug Terra. It's one of the many risks of being a Shane. A risk you'll someday face yourself, if you decide to follow in my footsteps. A long line of Shanes has made the trip down to Slug Terra. If you do choose to go, remember our deal. Not until I'm 15. I've told you all about my adventures in Slug Terra, and you'll have plenty of your own. Getting down there is gonna be the easy part. Getting back up, that'll be a lot harder for you. If you choose to go, it'll be a one-way trip until you learn the secret of how to get back home. I know we've always talked about making your first journey on the ground together, but you'll have to do this one on your own. I've told you so much about Slug Terra, but it only scratches the surface of what you'll see. You'll be traveling over 100 miles beneath the surface of the Earth, to a place only a handful of topsiders have ever seen. You'll be safe inside the carriage, just hold on tight. Ready, Burpee? Wow, Slug Terra. The world beneath our feet. I'm finally here. When you reach Slug Terra, there'll be a Shane hideout within a few hundred yards of the drop. Ready to check out our new home, Burpee? Kind of a mess. Inside, 
You'll find all the gear you're gonna need to keep the peace. Time to ditch the surface clothes, Burpee. Your own mecha beast will be waiting for you in the service bay. Happy birthday, son. Thanks, Dad. Though I was expecting something a little cooler. Oh, nice! LKE model? How about we call you Lucky? I usually keep a few extra blasters around, but you'll have to find your own slugs. That's going to be your most important task, Eli. The slugs are the key to everything down here. You're going to learn that they're much more than ammo. Huh? Hmm. Don't shoot! Don't shoot! Who are you? Who am I? The question is, who are you? I asked you first, and I'm the one holding a blaster. I see you are as clever as I, young man. Pronto! At your service! Tracker! Explorer! Monoid of many talents! Funny. Dad never mentioned you. Dad? Your father is Will Shane! <gasps> of course, I have a perfectly good explanation for this, you see. <sighs> All right! I, I never actually met Will Shane, but if I had... Oh, there would be no doubt. He would have begged me to be on his team. And should you, what good is a Shane without a tracker to lead him on his adventures? Yeah, well, Dad didn't mention anything about needing a tracker either. <sighs> and so, a dream dies. Perhaps we will meet again. If ever you pass through the Low Rock Caves, huh? by way of the Northern Cavern, or uh, Scorched Sparks, you know, a tracker might actually come in handy. Yes! Yes! Ah, you have made a wise choice, young Shane. My name is Eli. Hmm. A good name. Easy to pronounce. You, young Eli, will not be disappointed. Good. Because if I'm gonna fight evil, our first order of business is to catch me some slugs. Well, as a Shane, you must have an impressive arsenal of slugs. Show them to me. Yes, yes, you are very nice, but uh, where are the rest? There is no rest, but Burpee is awesome. You only have one slug? Gah! You need to win some experienced slugs in a battle. And I know just the place. It is a small local tournament. The competition should be no problem for a Shane. What's the hold up? We have slugs to win. Just one thing I need to do before we go. Been waiting my whole life to do this. <laughs> waiting to do what? Shoot a slug out of a blaster? Yep. Ready, Burpee? An inferno slug! Whoa! Way to go, Burpee! Now, how do you start one of these things? Check it out, Burpee! Wait, uh, you give your slugs names? Don't you? Stop that! Scarlet Beast? I guess that's a name. You know, my skills in observation are highly refined. It seems as if many common things are unfamiliar to you. I, uh, grew up in the Shane's most secret hideout. It was really out of the way. Uh, only the Shane's know about it. Uh, yes, of course. The Shanes have a lot of secrets, but none of them are as important as the one about where you come from. No one can know about the surface, Eli. There are too many dangers on both sides. These two worlds must be kept separate. What's going on, Pronto? Avert your eyes and keep moving. That guy looks like he could use some help. Uh, without the Shane around to keep the peace, the caverns of Slugthera have gotten, how should we say, a little rough around the edges. Well, there's a Shane around now. This is none of our concern. I'm sure you'll agree that a wise hero must choose his battles. This all you got? Ah, nothing but floppers in here. You need to go. <laughs> I got the claim to this trail. Unless you're Will Shane, you better keep on moving. That would be my dad. I'm picking up where he left off. <laughs> oh, 
is that a fact? Will Shane was someone to be afraid of. You're just a kid. And I'm the kid who's holding the blaster. You willing to try me? <laughs> Guess that's a yes. Thanks, Pronto. Who's Pronto? And you're welcome. You know, this road is filled with guys like that. You should be more careful. Wait! Who are you? There you are! Already dispensing the justice, I see? Stay off this trail. <laughs> Gonna need a whole lot more than a blaster and a molinoid to be a Shane kid. <laughs> I thought being a Shane was supposed to mean something. That guy thought I was a joke. If respect is what you want, you must earn it on the field of battle, like front to the brave. If you win this tournament, people will know that the Shade has returned to fight for justice and protect the innocent. And if I don't win? Chaos will continue to rule and you will be forever branded as a hopeless fool. Of course, this will never happen. You have this competition in the bag. Shane? Well, check this out. Kid thinks he's a shame! Uh, <laughs> 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 All right, you got the last spot in the qualifier. Good luck. You're gonna need it. Qualifier? Just one little duel to get you into the tournament. Nothing to worry about. Okay, cool. It'll be fun to finally get to duel someone. What? What? You've never... You've never been in a duel, but you're a shame. It's, uh, kind of a long story, and I don't think we want to share it with the other duelers, do we? No, of course not. Gah! I need to find you a sparring partner right away. I'll be back. Excuse me, you're in my shot. Oh, hey, it's you. Uh, thanks again for, uh, you know. What, saving your butt? It'll be our little secret. Well, I owe you. I'm Eli. Trixie, you told that guy you were a Shane. Is it true? Yep. I'm just here to win a few slugs before I go off and fight crime and stuff. Oh, what's with your camera? I'm filming my competition, looking for anything that might give me an edge. Whoa, 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 now! Whoa, whoa, whoa. <laughs> whoa, whoa, whoa. Who's that guy? John Bull. He's the one to beat if you plan on winning this thing. Haven't found a weakness yet, except for the fact that he's a total jerk. Shouldn't you be in there practicing? Yeah, my friend is getting me someone easy to spar with. Unless you're interested. And give away all my tricks? <laughs> no, thanks. I'd rather film you and learn yours. Besides, I think your friend already found someone. Eli Shane, meet Cord Ah, uh, What do you think? I think this could be extremely painful. You told me I'd be doing the Shane. That's just a kid. And you're a cave troll. Let me guess, you don't want to spar with me either. Are you kidding? I've always wanted to meet a cave troll. You'll never find anyone more loyal, honest, and brave than a cave troll. Uh, that's what my dad always used to say. Hmm. Well, clearly, he spent little time around Molinoids. Will Shane said that? Ah, oh, ah. come here, you. <laughs> <laughs> so I take it this means we're gonna duel? Take your pick. Floppers, huh? Great. What's not great? Floppers are useless. Every slug is useful. So, what do you know about dueling? What's to know? First you choose your slug, then you sling it. When it reaches 100 miles an hour, it transforms. Keep at it until your opponent gives up. My dad must have explained that to me like a hundred times. Yeah, well, explaining's not dueling. In this competition, you win, you get to pick a slug from your opponent. That means if you lose any match, even the qualifier... I could lose Burpee. Are you really willing to put it all on the line? I don't really have a choice, do I? Nope. That's the point. You always gotta be cool. Stand sideways. You're harder to hit that way. You do realize you're helping the competition. <laughs> That's cute. He thinks he's competition. Duel! <laughs> 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 
in the bed, bro. Don't target your opponent every time. Try moves that mess things up around them. Huh, you mean like this? Now that's what I'm talking about. Yes! Now that is the Eli Shade that I know! Or, uh, you know, just recently mad! Clever move. Oh! Oh! <laughs> and so is my time delayed Flatulorinkus. <laughs> How is it that you've never been in a duel? I made my dad a promise. I wouldn't take up slinging until I turned 15. Let me guess. Happy birthday? Yesterday. I got a good feeling about you, Eli. I mean, you may not have lots of skill, but you got plenty of heart. So, you think I'm ready? Definitely. Maybe. No. You're gonna do fine. In fact, I almost feel sorry for whatever noob you're up against. <laughs> <laughs> Remember what I said before about feeling sorry for the other guy? I totally take that back. You're going up against Shark Wire. Still not too late to quit while you're alive. Shay. <laughs> He's gonna demolish you. Come on, guys. He doesn't look that tough. What do you think, Burpee? All he uses are taserlings, and from what I can tell, he's sort of a one-trick pony. Some trick. I have a few tricks of my own, you know. You, you do? do? Uh, sure. You know some tricks, right? <laughs> oh. Look, I'll be fine. I'm sure I... Man, he is really tearing those targets to pieces. You know, taserlings are tough little slugs, but sometimes they'll miss fire if they get overworked. You don't say. They tell me you're a Shane. That's right. And all you got is a Flaringo and a bunch of floppers? Yep. You crazy, dumb, or both? Um, are there any other choices? Yeah, yeah. Take your pick. <laughs> He's got some good ones, Eli. Hey, hey, let's think about this. Uh, no, Cord. I've got a better idea. Which one of you guys wants to come with me? I'm a Shane, you know, so after this competition is over, you've got to be up for a life of adventure. What? You're asking the slugs? Nobody has the slugs. 
Welcome to the team, little guy. How do you like the name Jules? This is Burpee. You're a natural, but now that you're in the competition... Don't think we're doing you any favors. We're all in this to win. Then you better get a move on. Round one starts tonight in Scorch Sparks Cavern, and you'll be fighting them. <sighs> Dr. Black, do you need to see this? It's footage from a slug slinging match way out in Herringbone Cavern. Why would something like that be of any interest to me? Because this one says his name is Eli Shane. Think he's any relation? Well, if he is, we have ways of dealing with Shanes. Quite a few of them, actually. <laughs> My name is Eli Shane, and yesterday, I took a drop down to Slug Terror. That turned out to be the easy part. Down here, you need to sling slugs to survive. Some new friends got me into a tournament where I can get the slugs I need. You better get a move on. Round one starts tonight in Scorch Sparks Cavern. Now, all I gotta do is win. Thanks, Pronto. Yes, this journey is not so easy. Uh, yeah, I almost died. Four times. And surely you would have, if not for Pronto's magnificent tracking skills. But behold, round one of the tournament. Hey, hey, what took you so long? Molten lava, razor-sharp cliffs, and a molenoid with a constant need for pit stops. What? My brothers are very small. Why didn't you just take the road? Wait, there was a road? Ah, when you're with Pronto, you don't need roads. A good reason to bring me along with you when soon you are out fighting evil. All that matters now is you made it. The only question is, who are you gonna do it first? Just try not to die. That would be bad. can be very unpredictable. Okay, that was kind of scary, but also kind of awesome. What'd they do? Pick the most dangerous cavern they could find? Oh, don't be silly. Each round of the tournament is hosted by a different cavern. They're probably saving the truly deadly ones for last. Hey, Cord, uh, what's everyone standing around for? Shouldn't we be getting ready or something? That's the thing. They don't announce the matchups or the type of contest until the very last minute. I have no idea if I need to be preparing for a sharp shooting contest, a, a mecha bag duel. It could be anything. Leave it to me. I will use my expert skills in persuasion to find out early. Attention! The first round of the tournament will be one on one duels. Okay. It is one on one duels. Thanks for the tip, Pronto. My pleasure. Anything to give you the edge, my friend. Maybe you could have mentioned that hot lava won't hurt you. Ha! 
Nah, I gotcha. I saved the best for last. So did I. Mr. Shane. Now oh, I know which one you're gonna take. It sure was sweet knowing you. Your thresher slug's great, but come on. I can't take him. I know how I'd feel if someone took Burpee from me. You're an armor shelt, aren't you? I could use a cannonballer when I'm out helping people and kicking evil's butt. What do you say? I think I'll call you Banger. That okay with you? So, not too bad for my first real match, huh, Pronto? Pronto? <laughs> hey, there you are. Okay, yes, I am here. But certainly was not to find a new job if you lost. <laughs> but I can see from the look on your face that you were victorious. So let us not have any more of these silly accusations. I won my first round, too. Don't know you, don't uh, care. Uh, uh, did Pronto mention how happy he is that you won? The King of Sling versus Trixie Sting! <laughs> And that one wins me the duel. But I guess not everyone was so lucky. Totally. You should see the dude I just hammered. <laughs> Dr. Black. Maurice? What have I told you about interrupting me while I work? It's about that slug slinging tournament. And I should care because... The Shane kid, he's still in it. According to my guy, he might actually be good. You don't think he'll be a problem, do you? <laughs> in ten years, perhaps. But you still want me to keep an eye on him, right, boss? Leave. I'll take that as a yes. Come on, dudes! And do that! Floor it! We're only halfway to Rock Lock Cavern, and the next round is starting in less than an hour! Hey, I've been meaning to ask you. The cave trolls are like the best engineers, right? Well, I don't want to brag. So, why did you become a slug slinger? My clan wanted me to go into the family business. A lot of the passageways we use today were built by my people. But... Turns out slinging slugs is a whole lot more fun than busting rocks. Uh, yes, yes, yes. I, of course, come from a long, proud line of polenoid explorers. What about you, Trixie? Not much to say. I was tired of seeing bad people ride into my home cavern to cause trouble. Without a Shane around, somebody had to do something. I was the only one who wanted to fight back. That's partially why I make my videos, so people can see what's been happening in Slug Terra, good and bad. Tracking, however, is the Molinoid's greatest skill. Uh, speaking of that, uh, where exactly are we, Pronto? Oh, just a little shortcut I know about. Those are Shadow Clan markings. Is this one of their trails? Yes, at one time it was. But they haven't been seen here in years. Ah! Well, guess what? I think they've made a comeback. The Shadow Clan? I've always wanted to see one. Usually, if you get close enough to see one... It's the last thing you'll see. So, what do we do? Run! Eli, he meant run away! 
you guys get out of here. I'll try and distract them. <laughs> This was a bad idea. Uh, do we go in and get him? What were you thinking? I don't know what I was thinking. My dad always talked about them like they were no big deal. He said he ran into them all the time when he was out patrolling the caverns. Yeah, but your dad was Will Shane. You, you're just crazy. Rock Lock Cavern. Oh, they better have something good for this round. This next round will feature three on three team duels. Choose your partners! What do you say? Oh, come on. What's the worst that could happen? <laughs> Don't just sit there. Get some cover! <laughs> Who are these guys anyway? These three are the Powers Triplets, AKA the Power Trips. They've been training together since they were born. It's like they know what each other's gonna do before they do it. <laughs> Enjoying the match, I see. <laughs> you know, he may be Will Shane's son, but Pronto taught him everything he knows. Ooh, except for that. Ignore that. Slug him again, brother. Yes, sister. <laughs> Whoa, wait. One of those dudes is a girl. <laughs> We need to be working together like they do. Show me your slugs. Cord, you'll sling that phosphor. Trixie, we'll need your arachnid. Then we'll see what Banger can do. It takes weeks to bond with a new slug, Eli. Sometimes months. You can shoot it, sure. But to pull off a complicated move, there's no way a slug you just won will do exactly what you want it to do. I may be new at this, but I know when a slug is bonded with you. Cord, you draw them out. Then we fire on my signal. Go! Here goes nothing there, brothers! Now! Signature moves. Oh, winners, Team Shane! Hot five! Ugh. Hey, come on. You're leaving me hanging here. Okay, maybe later. Good, because we got to get going to the next round. You had better be right about this, Maurice. My time is precious. Western Caverns, driver. Dr. Black wants to watch the slug match. Let us see what this new Shane has to say for himself. I just heard. I'm sorry, bro. Um, no, I won. I'm in the finals. Yeah, against John Bull. Look what he did to me. 
But bro, you don't have the skills, and not to mention the body mass, to take on his rammers. I'm sorry to say it, dude, but that guy's gonna crush you. Go get him, kid! I'm rooting for you! Eli Shane is not signing any autographs. Pronto, however, has several poses available. The Slug Terrain Express. And it's not carrying just any passenger. Dr. Black? Why would he be here? Which one of you is Eli Shane? Okay, Burp. Who is that guy? Dr. Thaddeus Black. Your dad never mentioned him? People say he was the last one to see him alive. What your friends say is true. Will Shane was a true hero. I owe my life to him, in fact. Let's find a place to talk, shall we? My friends are coming with me. By all means. It's okay, guys. We're just gonna talk. A small perk of owning the main line of transportation is that one gets to travel in a certain style. Oh, so soft, like an angel's whisper. So Will Shane had a son. <laughs> uh, I'm not surprised. The Shanes and their secrets. <laughs> you were my dad's friend? Friend? <laughs> not exactly. Your father and I had our differences, but that's all in the past. You and I have a chance to start fresh. Perhaps someday, even work together. I've been told you're a little short on slugs. Consider this one a gift. What happened to that slug? Why, I improved it, young lady. I'll admit my first few attempts were unpredictable, but now, Perfection. That's not perfection. You made it into some kind of a ghoul. Ghoul? <laughs> I like that. You can't do that to slugs. They're the key to everything here. You could destroy Slug Terra. I seem to have heard that once before. I suppose it was silly of me to think a shame would accept it. We're done. Here in this little contest, you may think you're the hero, but out in the real world, Eli Shane, stay out of my way. I don't know who you are, but my slug seems to, and he doesn't like you. I don't either. I'm gonna be the new Shane. You better get used to it. <laughs> he's just a kid, boss. Shouldn't be any trouble. But he's also a Shane. And when the people have a shame to get behind, that can be very bad for business. <clears throat> Dr. Black, what do you want? To see you win today. I'm dueling a kid. You're dueling a shame. Never underestimate a shame. Well, I don't need your ugly slugs. You know who I am. You know what I'm capable of. You'll use it against the Shane boy. <laughs> Must be nice being daddy's boy and having everything handed to you. Wouldn't know. My dad's been gone a long time, and no one handed me this! Bro! Less talking! More remembering what I taught you! And what was that again? Don't talk when you should be blasting! <laughs> Shane is! Come on, Eli! 
Sorry, guys. One of you is gonna have to go. Huh. I don't need your slugs. Not when I have one of these. That's the ghoul! Black gave it to you, didn't he? Who cares? Get lost! I don't need you. And there's plenty more where this came from. If you choose to follow in my footsteps, Eli, it will be up to you to protect Slug Terra from all kinds of dangers. You're a Shane. You have a good heart. And whatever you choose, I'm proud of you. I've waited my whole life to sling slugs and be a Shane. I just always thought I'd be doing it with my dad. Now I'm gonna have to find a way to do it myself. Well, not completely by yourself. You will have Pronto to guide you on your journey. And I'll make sure you get there, buddy. I got your back. And I'll spread the word across like Terra. Everyone will know a Shane has returned. It could be dangerous. We laugh at danger. Most of the time, I'm going to be making it up as I go. That's how I live each day. We're going to go after Dr. Black. Whatever those ghouls are, we have to stop them from making more. Thought you'd never ask. All right. We're the new Shane gang. Where do we start? Somebody help! Guess that answers that. Let's ride! You mean to tell me that not one of you is up for a friendly duel? <laughs> You're not afraid of these, are you? They're just slugs. Wrong! Those aren't just slugs. They're ghouls. Well, if it isn't the new Shane come to save the day, I was wondering when you would show up. Those ghouls aren't welcome here, and neither are you. <laughs> Four against one. Not exactly a fair fight. Rules went out the window when you pledged your allegiance to Black, CC. Then we'll just have to level the playing field. And then I'll level the four of you. Chance, CC. Are you gonna go quietly, or is this gonna get loud? Really? Give him a break, Trixie. He's still figuring out this hero thing. <laughs> Minor 
setback? No big deal. Did you see the boosters he had for his gear? And he's slinging ghouls. We've got no match for that. Yeah, bro. You're the only one of us who's ever faced one. And that didn't end so well, remember? If you're trying to psych me up for this fight, it's not really working. But don't worry. I have an idea. Eli, that's just a stinker. It'll be useless against a ghoul. Which is exactly why he'll never see this coming. <laughs> that is so foul. And dumb. You had to know I was going to knock it right back at you. That was the idea. The way I see it, you have two choices. Take a cheap shot on me, in which case my friends open fire. Or you walk away. What's it gonna be? <laughs> Clever move, kid. You know you're gonna stink for weeks. Oh, it was worth it. Speak for yourself. You used to be a respected slug slinger. What happened to you? I saw an opportunity and I took it. And I'm not the only one signing on with Dr. Black. A new Shane may be back, <laughs> but you're not gonna make one bit of difference against Dr. Black and his ghouls. Oh, and uh, how's that Shane hideout working for you? Settling in? What are you getting at, CC? Oh, nothing. Except maybe while I was here entertaining these fine citizens, a few of my associates were doing a little redecorating for you. Consider it a housewarming present from the guy who gave me these. The hideout! This is so not cool. <sighs> Good news! My collection of glass figurines has been spared! Ah! I vow vengeance! Vengeance! Dr. Black did this to send us a message. He's gonna learn the Shane Gang doesn't rattle so easy. So what's the plan? We'll send Black a message of our own. First, we're gonna replace all the stuff we lost. Ooh, you know what that means. We're going to... Button and Sphinx. Wow. I don't even know where to start. I know. They got everything, from furniture to blaster upgrades. You can even get custom parts for your Mecha Beast. Cord, you're the gear expert. Think you can set us up with replacements for what got trashed? Definitely. <sighs> that ought to do it. Should replace all the stuff we lost, plus a few upgrades. You know. To help us get our point across. Just one question. Do we have enough gold to pay for this? No gold. Only slugs. I've got some good ones here. Nah, -uh. No way. We're not buying groceries, Eli. You want something valuable, you have to trade something valuable in return. We don't really need all this stuff, do we? I'd rather keep the slugs. And what about Black? He's already got an advantage with his ghouls. We can't afford not to have the best gear. These guys are my team. I'm really starting to get to know them. You see? That is why you never get friendly with the ammo. I know how much your slugs mean to you, Eli, but sometimes you just have to make a trade. We all do it. I'm not happy about this. You've been a great slug, Jules, but we really need the gear. <laughs> Wow. Uh, it'll do. I think we have a deal. Whoever you end up with, they'll take good care of you. Maybe I'll see you again. Not 
likely kid. Nightmare Ridge. We must use caution. Everyone, I've been thinking. About the wonders of me, no doubt. We made a mistake. You doubt the navigational skills of the great Pronto? I'm talking about Jules. We should never have made that trade. I thought we went over this. You want to stop Black? Then you need the best gear. And to get the best gear, sometimes you gotta give up a slug or two. We gotta go back and get him. What is it with him and his slugs? What do you mean, gone? We were here an hour ago. What can I say? It's been traded. If you want a refund, I've got a pair of floppers. <laughs> Pass. I want Jules back. Sorry, kid. He's gone. Well, we tried. Not so fast, Pronto. That shopkeeper was hiding something. I'm gonna find out what. A conspiracy? Bonus. Stand aside. This takes great skill and a delicate touch. Well, well, I could have done that. Whoa. There must be hundreds. What are they all doing down here? Huh? Business has been slow, but there's still a lot of first-rate slugs in here. Powerful ones with, with lots of training. Just how Dr. Black likes. <sighs> Load them up. Dr. Black is behind this. And what do you bet he's planning on turning those slugs into freaky ghouls? Yeah? Well, he's not getting jewels, or any of these slugs. Come on. Shh, we're getting you out of here. That does not belong to you. Says who? Dr. Black. Well, I don't see him here right now, and there are way more of us than there are of you. <laughs> who are you, anyway? They call me Diablos Nacho. All right, Nacho. There are two ways this can go down. Okay, three. That's because you're grabbing mine. Oh, well, that's better. Okay, so you got us. What happens now? It's okay, Jules. I won't let them take you. Business with Dr. Black. A lot of people do, kid. He makes it hard to say no. Besides, they're just slugs. You don't have any idea what he's doing with them, do you? And I don't think I want to. We're gonna get Jules and the rest of those slugs, too. I'm not gonna let Black turn them into ghouls. You realize that means going straight to Black Citadel. We said we wanted to send him a message. Now we can hand deliver it. You. Eli Shane. I'm here to see Dr. Black. Wait here. Okay, follow me. 
Easy for you to say. In there. Where's Black? Indisposed. What can I do for you? For starters, I want my slut back. <laughs> what I'm asking of you is so little compared to what I'm offering. Your loyalty and service in exchange for the most powerful weapon Slug Terror has ever seen. I know you are men of action, not words. So am I. So I'll put it simply, take the power I've offered and join me. Okay, dudes, let's spring these slugs and mission accomplished ourselves out of here. A uh, problem? Jules isn't here. We're too late. So, uh, did you always want to be a henchman, or is it something you just kind of fell into? Okay. Any idea when Black's gonna show? I know I kind of surprised him by dropping in like this, but... On the contrary, I've been expecting you. I don't know how I'm going to tell Eli about Jules. You. Uh, hey, bro. <sighs> Smash it down. <laughs> we got to get out of here. Not without the slugs. No, like this. to black slugs. Get them. <laughs> Maurice, leave us. So, let's get down to business. You do know why I invited you here, don't you? Invited? Guess the invitation must have gotten lost in the mail. But you did get the message I left in your little clubhouse. That's why you're here now, isn't it? Partly. Mostly I'm here to get my slug back. <laughs> really? Is this what you're looking for? Jules! Think it over. <laughs> Good boy. Join me and you can have him. And in a far more powerful state than he is now. So good. <laughs> Did you honestly think you could just waltz into my home and actually <laughs> beat me? Uh, yeah. Starting to wish I had some of those upgrades, though. <laughs>
to be like this. But then, sons do have a way of repeating their father's mistakes. <laughs> ah, good. We're all here. Your friends can witness the end of another Shane. They'll soon follow. You put far too much faith in your slugs. That Infernus can't help you. Wanna bet? We gotta get out of here, Burpee. Show them what you've got. <laughs> I think you made your point, little guy. Now might be a good time to go. No argument here. <laughs> Back around the other side. No. Let them go. He got the message. Eli Shane won't be coming back here anytime soon. Why not make him pay? Oh, he will. They all will. But for now, He's far more useful as a reminder of what happens when even a Shane tries to challenge me. Well, that wasn't a total disaster. You guys were great, all of you. Black was wrong. There is nothing more important than our slugs. If we're gonna do this right, if we're gonna stop Black, we'll need more of them, lots more. They'll need training too. Still a lot of moves our slugs can learn. And don't forget the gear. I know you don't think it's that important, Eli, but you just leave that part to me. I'll never let Black get the edge. Thanks, Cord. It's a deal. And let us not forget how we must band together to achieve an even greater task. Like what? Cleaning up Pronto's room, of course. Who's with me? Ah? Huh? Eh? Oh, come on. Someone's got to be with me. This bed won't make itself! Careful, Cord. We're right on top of them. Yeah, yeah right. Sorry. There's nothing but empty around here. Maybe we just need to take a closer look. Frost crawlers. Remember, Eli, they can be fierce. Of course, they look a lot fiercer when they hit 100 miles per hour. Not to interrupt, but uh, please let me know when it is a good time to point out that it was I, Pronto, who led us here. How about after we catch one? I'll get the snares. I have the gloves. How about we just try talking to one of them? Yeah? Hey there. I'm looking for some powerful slugs to join my team. Like you. Oh, no! Uh, I'm sure they will 
be fine. All those slugs transforming together could cause a chain reaction. Guys, it's getting pretty frosty in here. Too bad about the slug, though. Huh? Check it out, he came back. Guess things always work out for the best. <laughs> Bro, I've been telling you, your slugs have gotten too powerful for a blaster like that. It was just a matter of time before. <laughs> Very realistic. Thanks, yeah, I'll be here all week. How long will it take you to fix it? I'd say about... forever. Oh. I'm pretty good about amping things up, but this needs an expert. Only one blaster smith I know of could fix that. Red Hook. That name sounds familiar. It should. All the best slingers used to use him. Including your dad. His skill is legendary, yes. As is his foul temper. <laughs> <laughs> I'm not looking for a new best friend. I just want my blaster fixed. Lead the way, Prano. Follow me. Welcome to Quiet Lawn, home of Red Hook. I thought you guys said this place was nice. Well, it used to be. I guess the people here are kind of shy. Pronto knows what to do. <clears throat> Hello? You! Uh, this is Pronto! I guess they like their quiet, too. You'd be quiet, too, if you lived under them. Renuker slugs. Knock those things down and it's kaboom time. It must be stressful living underneath those things. We can live just fine with the slugs. It's the Hula Gang that's causing all the trouble. The uh, Hula what? <laughs> yeah. Hula Gang. Come on, guys. Hey! What are you looking at? Your artwork. Is that a kitty? It's cute. You might want to work on your manners, especially when you talk to the guys running this no-good town. I'll keep that in mind for when I do. Do you really want to get into a fight with a broken blaster? I know you. You're the Shane kid. You better get lost. We're the Hula Gang. Official employees of Black Industries, which means you got a problem with us, you're going to have a big problem with Dr. Black. Oh, you don't have to worry about that, because I already got a problem with him. <laughs> Without your team, I bet you're not so tough. Then you shouldn't have any trouble beating me in a little trick shot contest. I'm challenging you. Ha! <laughs> you 
you got more guts than brains. I'm running to town for black. I don't have time for games. You win, you get my slugs. All of them. <laughs> Your whole arsenal? You lose, you leave town. <laughs> yeah, whatever, kid. You just lost all your slugs. Bro, what if he beats you? You're really gonna risk burpee and all your slugs? The possibility did cross your mind when you challenged him, right? Uh, yeah, but it's cool. I have a plan. <laughs> Excellent! He has a plan! <laughs> what is it? Um, when? Hmm? Yes! All right! Here! Now you can't ask for a do-over on account of a busted blaster. Thanks. Though, half a blaster is more than I need to kick your butt. <laughs> Beat that. Not bad. Let's see if I can do any better. <laughs> In your face! In your face! <laughs> yeah, come here, you little goo. Win it! One zip, Eli! Nice work. Trick shots! Best two out of three! No, not you! But none of your slugs are a match for my Flaringo. Let's see how this frost crawler flies. First to hit the flagpole! Go! <laughs> This is it. Winner take all. Dude, I won like six shots ago. This cavern is full of those Grenuker slugs. Whoever knocks the most down wins. No! Shh! No! Those slugs aren't bothering anyone up there. Who cares? They're just slugs. <laughs> You can show yourselves out. You're all I have left? You're useless! You don't explode, you don't freeze things! You don't do anything but take up space! Careful there. You almost stepped on that slug. That's it! I had it with you! Let's duel! I guess you won't be giving me back that loner? This means war. <laughs> My slugs are reaching velocity. Cord, I need a boost. You got it, buddy. Guess it takes a lot to knock those things down. If you're interested, I got room for one more. Actually, a lot more. <laughs> Dr. Black is gonna hear about this. Every one of you just made a huge mistake. They're probably coming back. And they'll find us waiting. Now can we go to Red Hooks? Mr. Red Hook? I've told you kids a dozen times to get lost! He seems nice.
Uh, we've never met. I'm just looking to get a blaster fixed. You're not with those hula gang clowns? Nope. We're the ones who got rid of them. For now. Hmm. Ah, a red hook! <laughs> Question, did you call yourself red hook before you got the hook or after? And was the hook red when you got it or...? Please, sir. I need your help. All right, come in. But you're interrupting my lunch. Ah, excellent! I'm famished! Oh. Whoa. I didn't think they made tools like this anymore. They don't! Tell me what you want and get out of here. I got the slugs. I just need a blaster to shoot them. That's all the slug you got? <laughs> you better run, boy. We're not running. Someone needs to protect this town. Mm -hmm. Something familiar about you. You sure we haven't met? Uh... Let me see your blaster. Can you fix it? It's been real lucky for me. <laughs> lucky it didn't kill you. That thing was a piece of junk when it was new. I don't fix junk. Uh, <coughs> one moment, please. <laughs> this man obviously requires a, a delicate touch. But do not fear. Pronto knows just what to say. was a tougher partner than I thought. You make this right, or I will grind you into paste. <laughs> ah. Maurice, who exactly is this? No recruit. Name's Billy. We sent him down a quiet lawn cavern to convince Red Hook to work for us. Did you know? And let me guess. This cave is fighting back. It's not them. It was the Shane kid. Came into town like he owned the place. And he did that to you. You need my help. That's what I was hoping you'd say. I'd... Uh... It's Billy, am I right? An example must be made of the Shane boy. I'm going to give you and your friends a little more firepower. Ghoul slugs. Ever seen one up close? Mm -mm. Ah, but you've heard of them. Imagine all the power within a slug, twisted to serve only you. Unpredictable. <laughs> but they make up for it in pure savage fury. Not even a shame can stand up to my ghouls. Now, which one of you pathetic lumps is next? <laughs> Seems like the town's getting back to normal. Well, as normal as you can get living under a pile of exploding slugs. Where's Pronto? At Red Hooks. Still groveling, but no time for that. The Hula Gang are on their way! <laughs> Come back! This is your town! Why won't they fight? It's quiet, Long Cavern, remember? We're gonna help these people stand up for their town. Not unless you get your blaster fixed. Hopefully, Pronto has softened Red Hook up enough to help out. Uh, so, uh, on behalf of my father and, uh, and his father's father, I am uh, very, 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 very sorry. How many times do I have to tell you? Get out of my house! Oh. Uh, uh, then also, I apologize. Uh, my apologies apologize. The groveling time is over, Pronto. The Hula Gang's coming and I need you with me. Red Hook, are you gonna fix my blaster or not? No. Fine. Then I'll face him without it. Come on, Pronto. You're a shame, aren't you? That's right. How'd you guess? Because you're acting like one. 
I once saw Will Shane take down the entire McDougal gang with only a dust puff slug and a slingshot. Never knew he had a kid. Dad wanted me out of the spotlight. And now you've stepped right into the center of it. You plan on going after Black? I plan on fighting the bad guys wherever I find them. <sighs> well, then you're gonna need this. Only made two of these. Your old man had the other one. I don't know what to say. Say you'll be the man your father was. We're off to fight these hooligangers. Pronto grants you the honor of assisting us in this historic battle. Uh, I can make them. Never was one to shoot them. You've done enough. All I need is a fighting chance. Come on, Pronto. Uh, uh, thank you. Uh, thank you again. Go get him, kid. Is everyone ready? Pronto was born ready. Let's get rid of these clowns once and for all. With this new blaster, it shouldn't be a problem. Um... Problem? They've got ghouls. <laughs> I'll make this quick and painful! Go ahead and try. Blast him! Now this is nice. in the fight. But these people said no. I'm not talking about the people. Pronto, you still have that sonic snare thingy? You're not thinking what I think you're thinking. Yep. Now we got him! <laughs> <laughs> okay, Burpee, let's rally the troops. <laughs> Shane, I still have one more jewel. Okay, little guy, you're all I have left. Make us proud. That worthless slug. This is over. <laughs> No longer a ghoul slug. So that's what you do. You're a healer. This isn't just any healer, Eli. This one cures ghouls. A healer? No way! Uh, come on! 
bad guys defeated, new blast of for Eli. Not a bad day's work. And we got a cool new slug in the process. You do know healers are like the rarest slugs in Slug Terra, right? Really? <laughs> yes, yes! Pronto the Magnificent deserves <laughs> much praise. Take a bow, Doc. And your slugs still aren't learning new moves? Why, yes I do. Are the other slingers getting the best slugs, leaving you with floppers? No good lazy stinking floppers, yes! Tired of never knowing what slug to use, or even if it's worth using at all? Nike's reading my mind! Here at Club Slug, we know you have better things to do than waste your time getting your hands dirty, making your slugs more powerful. Oh, you're preaching to the choir, my friend. Back up a little. This slug learned five new moves in a single weekend. And I didn't have to do anything but sit back and watch while enjoying a relaxing massage at your fully equipped spa. Thank you, Sergeant Slug. I could use a pedicure. So what are you waiting for? I'm Sergeant Slug, and I say get up, pack your bags, and let me do the work so you don't have to. That's an order. Sir, yes, sir. I'll apologize now for what's gonna happen to you in a few seconds. Too bad your threats aren't as strong as your breath. I'm a cave troll. What do I care about breath? Good point. Uh, what are you guys doing? Practicing the fine arts of psyching out your opponent. Less psyching and more slinging. So worked up, Cord. It's just practice. For you, maybe. A few months ago, you didn't even know what end of the blast of the slug came out. Now I can't even get a shot in. Okay, oh. Pronto? What's with all the luggage? Ah, yes. Very good question. Allow me to ask all of you. Are you tired of spending hours with tedious tooling? Uh, no. That's the best part of being a slug slinger. Yeah, when you win every time. Are other slingers leaving you in the dust? Well... It's never bothered me. Yes, it does. And that is why I have paid for all of us to spend a luxurious weekend at Club Slug. <laughs> yeah, I'm a slinger, not a dancer. It's not that kind of club. They advertise on late night vid screen. It's like a boot camp for slugs and a vacation for slingers. Vacation? Really? Oh, you could use one, Eli. You've been working so hard. And while you're sipping fresh squeezed nectars by the heated pool, your slots will be gaining power and experience. All 
in one weekend. Well, that's hard to swallow, but the pool does sound pretty nice. If it helps me get a leg up on you, Eli, I'm in. How much did it cost us? Uh, can you put a price on, on success? How much, Pronto? Uh, <laughs> did I mention we got a group discount? Only half our gold. Pronto? Oh, I can't believe you. I was saving for a new blaster. We all worked hard for that gold, Pronto. And that's why you need a vacation. You see, it, it all evens out. If this doesn't work, I better get my gold back. Sorry, no refund. Guess we'll just have to load up at the buffet to get our money's worth. Here we are at Club Slug. We're about to put this non-traditional way to power up your slugs to the test. But first, let's meet the other guests. Hi, I'm shooting a short documentary on our stay here. What's your name and why are you at Club Slug? Name's Waylon, and I'm here to power up my slugs. Duh. On the weekend, me and the boys like to kick back and sling a few. After this, my slugs are gonna rule. Woo! That's nice. And you are? You must be the only person in Slug Terra who hasn't heard of the Croesus clan. If Club Slug is all it claims to be, I may just buy the place. Uh, snob, excuse me. What about you? Get that thing out of my face. Okay. All right. Line up and stand straight. You floppers ready to do some heavy lifting? Eddies, the only floppers who are going to be working here are your slugs. They do the work, so you don't have to. I see we have a Shane with us today. It'll be an honor to train up your slug, son. Oh, I'm just here for the water slide. Uh, no offense, sir, but I think this sounds a little too good to be true. No offense taken, young man. I hear it all the time. But by the end of this weekend, you are going to be a believer. Come on, everyone. I will show you how it's done. Wow. Without giving away any trade secrets, here's how it works. First of all, who has a slug I can use as a demonstration? Oh, use mine, use mine. Look how eager the little guys are. They know what's good for them. My special blend of slug chow allows for a quick recharge, and here's why they'll need it. Oh boy, this is pretty cool. Once the slug is loaded in the machine, it's slung to velocity. Transformed, fired into the target tube, and shuttled back into the magazine, where it's fired again, and again, and again, and again. Keeping them going all day and all night. This gives them the experience they need to learn new moves. Faster than you can imagine. And the slugs love it. Hand over your slugs, everyone, and we'll give them all a spin. Woo! In a finger. My slug looks meaner already. So, what do you say, Eli? Ready to give my method a try? Your slugs sure are. My slugs and I like powering up old school. We're all on vacation this weekend. <laughs> you Shanes are famous for being traditional. Well, I've already got your gold. Okay, everyone, go out and relax. That's an order. Woohoo! Except you guys, of course. Come on, guys, let's check out that water slide. <sighs> I gotta admit, Pronto, I can get used to this. You better leave a big tip, Cord. This is a sweet deal. Daddy always said, why do something you can pay an underling to do? And I can pay plenty. 
When I get home, my brother's gonna be the one that pays. With a stinker slug right in his rotten face! Woo! See? Who needs some crazy machine when you have this? Listen up, everybody. It's been a few hours now. How'd you like to see firsthand how your slugs are progressing? Yeah! Totally! Thought so. Who's up for a friendly duel? Did someone say duel? Count me in. That's right, Eli. Who wants to test their new and improved slugs against a shame? Yeah, I'll do it. You are on. Okay, boys. One slug, one shot. I am taking you down. You are slug me, Eli Shane. You hear that? Keep talking, Cord. That's about all you can do. No, not this time, Burpee. Go easy on him, Banger. Enough talk! Get ready, Slingers! On my mark! So, Eli Shane, still think my system's a joke? Eli! You okay, buddy? Uh, yeah, I think so. You beat me. You're right, I did! I beat you! <laughs> I did, I beat you! With a whole new move! That was amazing! I know, right? Yes! Now I wish I'd back on you! Now, are you convinced? That was pretty convincing. Are you okay, Banger? What happened? You got owned is what happened! Oh! <laughs> Alright, back to the machine, tough guy. Takes a few sessions for him to get seasoned like old Butch here. Oh, Minek, Minek! Ha ha! The mighty Pronto will defeat Eli even better than the troll. Soon enough, son. How about it, Eli? Ready to get off the sidelines and into the game? Okay, maybe we can give Banger a spin and see how he does in a rematch. Are you sure you're okay, buddy? I really thumped you good back there. No, it's cool. I'm glad you finally got a shot off on me. It's just hard to wrap my head around the idea that a machine can do all this. Yeah, it's hard for me to wrap my head around the idea that I just kicked your butt, but there's your butt, and here we are. How much proof do you need? Looks like Banger's convinced. He may just be a slug, but he knows what he wants. Hand him over, and I'll fire him up. Don't worry, Banger. I'll be right here. He doesn't look worried. He looks pumped. Everything's fine, kid. I've trained hundreds of slugs in this thing. Well, he seems to like it. He loves it! Just wait a morning. I'll make a believer out of you yet. What did I tell you, kid? Okay, I'm a little impressed. How do you feel, Banger? I think he's had enough. Suit yourself. Guess it's time for breakfast, guys. All you can eat buffet. Oh, man. Woo! Excuse me, coming through on your left, Molinoid. Come on, Banger. You've had enough. Whoa! Banger? All you can eat. Oh, a noble concept. Pronto must fuel the flames. Have it soon to be even greater than this? 
with wieners. Banger would never try to bite me. That machine makes them crazy. Hey, the crazier the better for what I'm planning to do with them. And did you see how deflated Korg Slug was after our duel? And how Sergeant Slug hustled him out? He's hiding something. He said it takes a while to season them. Look at Butch. That slug is fucked. Woo! Look, maybe something is going on, Eli, but this has cost us half our gold. We gotta see it through. Graduation is in a few hours. We'll stick around until then and keep an eye on the slugs. I know the slugs that go through that machine come out wrong. I'm going to figure out why. Come on, Banger. Maybe a little workout will settle you down. It's okay, Banger. You couldn't help yourself. Are you okay? You look like you're losing steam. What's going on? A scam is what's going on. I fell for the claim, same as you. Now look at my slugs. That machine makes them crazy. I thought so. How? It gets them all pumped up, then they collapse after a few shots, and you gotta pay for another round. Sarge calls it maintenance. His slugs seem fine, but they're always charging up. That's just what I needed to hear. Congratulations, grads! As promised, here is your new and improved ammo! Best slugs money can buy! Oh, can't wait to try them! Woo! Don't forget to tell everybody you know what Club Slug did for you! You mean whip all these people off? These artificial level ups don't last, guys, and you're gonna have to keep coming back here for more. Dude! I like coming here. My money, my slugs. Why do you care? I care when it hurts the slugs. I care when it's dangerous for you. There's a reason it takes a long time to train a slug. It's so you'll have the experience to handle it. This way, somebody's gonna get hurt and bad. These slugs are no better than ghouls. You may be ashamed, but you're also bad for business. Anybody who's with me gets a free month's maintenance. Looks like we got ourselves a deal. And a duel. <laughs> we got your back, Eli. It's not my back I'm worried about. You do not want to fire those slugs. I paid good money for these things, and I'm gonna use them. Make way! Pronto can stop this! Pronto, go! I got a whole army of 
amped up slugs, kid. What do you got? Friends I fought with. Friends I can count on. Right, Burpee? <laughs> Your bumped up slugs are deflating, Sergeant. Funny thing, I had just a solution to that problem. You're gonna shut me down? I don't think so. Your slugs are beat. Mine are pumped. You sure you're up for this? Let's make it count. power up and we almost got killed but now at least no one else will get scammed as much as i hate to admit it you were totally right about this bogus boot camp i'd never have gotten the drop on my brother with the bunk slugs they barf out here maybe i'll try the old-fashioned way next time and when i say i i mean our butler and perhaps the cook and chauffeur that was still pretty awesome though you know the way our slugs went totally nuts Woo! <laughs> waylon not awesome yeah, in case you haven't noticed, I'm not a real fast learner. <laughs> oh, please be there, please be there, <laughs> please be there. What's wrong, Pronto? Is one of your slugs under there? Slugs? Bah! I'm trying to find... <gasps> our money! <laughs> now we can take advantage of an interesting opportunity I have recently become aware of. Opportunity? Some people never learn. Apparently, some genius has devised a method of supercharging mecha beasts so they run five times faster. Right, so. yeah. Seriously? Sunday, Sunday, Sunday! It's the Slug Run! As always, a new deadly course with new deadly challenges! And a new deadly awesome slug as the prize! So awesome they could kill you! Death by awesome! This year, we've got one of the rarest slugs of all! A crystalline slug! One surfaces every hundred years! So expect the most ruthless wild racers on a course so dangerous. It's insane! Um, that. Yeah, the slug run is always amazing. Total Mecha Crush Fest. I can't wait to watch it. What do you mean, watch? No, no way. You've done a ton of crazy things since I met you, but when it comes to this race, you're gonna have to trust me. Or not. Ugh, this is gonna be <laughs> awesome. It's a race! How bad could it be? Welcome, Welcome racers. racers! Make sure your death and dismemberment forms are filled out. As always, when you lose limbs, it's up to you to pick them up. Unless you lose both arms, in which case, no high fives for you. And remember, the slugging rule will be in effect. Oh, okay, well that's good. I'm not bad with my blaster. Um, the slugging rule is that you can't use your blaster against other riders. Shouldn't that be called the no slugging rule? If you want to survive, you need to be like Pronto. Razor sharp focus, nerves of steel, and never let anything get in your head. <laughs> See though, my life no nemesis. <laughs> 
So, Sido, we meet again. Yes. Nice to meet you too. Oh, best of blessers on my day. Oh, wait, wait. No, it is me. Wrong toad. Your life long nemesis. But, get, sit, come on, hit me. What? What? Go on. Always a joy chatting with a fan. Hold that look. Thanks, Pronto. Got it. Oh. A mole mecca. That's cute. I take great pride in my roots. I am a mole on a mole, doubling my moleness. Ooh, Pronto, your nemesis just claimed to be twice the mole you are. Any reaction? <laughs> Seriously, that's just rude. <laughs> Don't worry, Burpee. We'll take it easy. We're just here to have fun. And if we happen to win, a bonus. <laughs> Pronto? What do you... Zido thinks he is more mole than Pronto? Pronto will show him who is the moliest of the molenoids. <laughs> Are you racers ready? Yes, I know. I'm right on time. <laughs> Vance Volt doesn't do standing around. So if we could just, you know. A sure thing, Mr. Volt. Go! Three-time champion and the guy to beat. Not that any of you have any chance to do that. Now that I've completely overhauled my mecha, thanks to my new sponsor, Black Industries. <laughs> Volt works for Black? Black must be after the tunneler. You know what this means? Yes. I must defeat Sido. <laughs> no, now we gotta win to stop Volt from... Hey, wait up! Slug run, aren't you? Ha! I've been riding mecha since. Wait, has it really only been since January? You want some advice, newbie? What? Work on my racing banter? Don't follow me if you want to live. Who does this guy think he is? Take too long. If fans can take a shortcut, so can I. Okay, this was a bad idea. I 
told you not to follow me. Everyone all right? Uh, looks like we're all good. Or maybe not. You think you have bested me, Sido? But I have you right to where I want to. Feel the wrath of Pronto the Destroyer! Ah! Oh, oh, oh! My aching brains! Sido! Well, it looks like this race just became a bit of a challenge. You do know this isn't the shortcut. I've gotten out of worse. I know Vance Fold is intimidating, <laughs> but there's no need to shh. Shadow Clan. Something tells me they're not in the race. Yeah, something tells me you're right. Let's move. This leads to a dead end. We're trapped. So that's the way it's gonna be. What do you think you're doing? Mostly trying not to die so I can get back to the race. This is the race. Everything's a race. And you just broke the slugging rule. The rule is that I can't fire at another racer. I don't think those things are trying to win a race. If you've got any brains, you'll drop out before this race kills you. You okay? I will be once I best Sido. Yeah! 
to learn how he does that. Nice work! Now get back home safe! I wanted to. You're nuts, kid! You're willing to risk your life just to get a slug? I can't let you win that slug for Black, but I don't need to cheat to win. Besides, so far I haven't seen anything I can't handle. <laughs> um, until now. race. If we get killed, he's totally gonna rub it in our faces. So I hope this works. <laughs> hang on, guys! Wait. I'm the one who needs to hang on. No, no, no! no. <laughs> Thank you. Thank you. Oh, looking good. <laughs> All right. Excuse me, folks. Sorry, kid. No prize for coming in second. Except this time. Oh, really? Are, are you sure? Well, I won. That's a good enough prize for me. Like I said, I'm a racer, not a slinger. What about Black? He's expecting you to give this to him. Well, seeing what you put on the line just to stop him from getting that thing, something tells me he shouldn't have it. Oh, but he will have it. I'll give him the slug myself. <laughs> What? You work for Black! Do you really think Black would entrust everything to a show-off like Vance oh. Boat? Oh. I was his hidden mole in the race. You could say I'm a mole who's a mole on a mole, tripling my molitude to unfathomable awesomeness. Black plays all the angles. That's why he always gets what he wants. He doesn't have what he wants yet. <laughs> you really think you're that fast? I don't know. Well, let's find out. <laughs> All right, Mole. Hand back that 
slugger, I'll hold that thought for a second. You were saying? I can see by your face that you're impressed. Black compensated me quite well to be his backup plan. Now, drop your weapon. A pretty please. Where have I heard that before? You? Ah! Now you remember me. Pronto! Your life! Your nemesis! <laughs> You can't bury a mole! I'll dig my way back to get you! <laughs> One day! The name is Pronto! Worm Rider! Uh, sorry about your slug. Are you kidding? As long as Black doesn't have it, I'm cool. Nice shooting. Nice worm. And then Pronto saved the day. Yeah, whatever. I'll eat my wrench if that's really what happened. You'll have to take Eli's word for it. I was out like a light. Actually, that's exactly what happened. Ha <laughs> ha! Stuck eating cave troll! <sighs> Sorry we didn't make it to the finish line in time. Yeah. But the important thing is... Pronto crushed Sido! And we stopped Black. I'll take that as a win any day. Even though you lost. To me. How's it look? She's good as new. Plus, a few extra touches. You got quite a team here. And you have quite a leader. You know... Black's going to be coming after you, if you want to join up with us. <laughs> Thanks, but uh, I told you, Vance Volt is a racer, not a slinger. Besides, if he wants me, Black will have to catch me first. You think it's as simple as that? No way you're just riding out of here. Until you teach me some of your moves. You could stand to learn a few new moves. So could you. Try and keep up! Well, if you really want to learn a truly awesome move, watch as I demonstrate how I rode the mother of all crystal worms. I turned to the worm and said, Worm, prepare to be tamed! I am going to ride you, and you are going to like it! I could tell by the smell of her underbelly, she knew who was boss. Now, here's the best part. Uh, uh, hey! Where did everybody go? There he goes! We're never gonna catch that thing, Eli! This is like a game to them! Oh, so that explains why this is so much fun! Tricks, court, head him off! And Pronto will bravely take the rear! Okay. <laughs> He's hard to catch now! Just imagine when he transforms! This pursuit has doomed me! We'll never make it across the chasm! We're totally gonna make it! I just put new upgrades in all our Mecha Beasts!
I just gave these a complete overhaul. Did you have to add any wings? No. Oh, oh, that's a good idea. Impressed by the so called upgrade. <laughs> ah. We just stay still, pronto. I'm trying to get this. I'm trying to get it. There. You see, I told you those arachnid slugs are a pain in the hiney. Yeah, but that slug also saved ours. Without the web, we wouldn't be here. No. I question your mechanical aptitude, Mr. Cave Troll. Yeah, you're like a Mecha Beast guru. What happened? I don't know what happened. This wasn't my fault. Well, perhaps if you wasted less time playing the jokes on Pronto. I don't waste time pranking you. Well, actually. Ah, Cave Corn. <laughs> Comfy. <sighs> ah, sandwich. <laughs> <laughs> I don't know, Pronto. That looks like time well spent to me. <sighs> but back to the mechas. What caused them to stall on us like that? <sighs> I'll take another look under the hood. Turbo connectors check out. Power transmission is optimal. Thermocouplers are up and running. <sighs> right now, I'm stumped. My buddy Grendel's the head engineer at the Western Mech Forge, so I get service upgrades before anyone. Our mechas should run perfectly. <laughs> Definitely not supposed to do that. Can't we just take them back to the forge? They could probably figure it out. <sighs> what did I say? You know how proud cave trolls can be. He'd rather eat a Toxus slug than admit mechanics defeat. Cord, you've got to go face your shame for yourself. Besides, wouldn't you be like a hero if you brought some big problem to the Forge's attention? Uh, yeah, yeah, maybe. And it is decided. Though the way may be fraught with danger, brave Pronto will guide you to the Western Forge. Wow, now that's a factory. You see? I told you I could lead you to the Western Forge. Yeah, well, there are signs everywhere pointing to this place. Plus, it's like half a mile high. And yet, I found it. Beast Forge. Yeah, we're here to see Grendel. Can I help you? I'm here to see the head engineer. You're in luck. That would be me. I'm Darius Yorman, the new head engineer. What happened to Grendel? He's no longer with the company. He's not? Huh. Well, can somebody take a look at our mechas? They nearly killed us. Oh, really? I recalibrated the interlink servos, flushed out the hydraulics, even replaced the pressure seals. Hmm. Did you try jiggling the on switch? <laughs> I'm kidding. <laughs> you say these glitches started yesterday. I put in the recall parts last week and did a field diagnostic, but... Wait, wait. You already upgraded? How is this possible? I'm the advanced field tester. New parts ship out to me automatically, way before anyone else. Well, good for you. Give the mechas a level three diagnostic, top to bottom. Yes, sir. So, how about a tour while we wait? I'd love to see how this place works. Well... <clears throat> Grendel always gave tours. I suppose a quick walk through the plant would be okay. And all our raw materials are imported from the eastern caverns now. Over 400 tons of steel smelted every month. And not a drop goes to waste. Don't touch that. Unless you want a wave of molten metal dumped on your head. I am happy with my head just the way it is, thank you. 
handsome. Oh, cool! That must be the Mecca's heart. Beating with the same power that flows through our slugs. <sighs> Beautiful, isn't it? I still don't know how they do it. Molecular transference? <laughs> that was a figure of speech. You're a pistol. So the Western Forge builds all of Slug Terra's mecha beasts? Every single one of them. Wow. I hope what happened to our mechas doesn't happen to anyone else's. Don't worry. We'll get to the bottom of this. Without mecha beasts, Slug Terra would be without reliable transportation, and everyone would have to find other ways to get around, like Dr. Black Slug Terran Express. We wouldn't want that now, would we? You're late. The last person who made me wait became dinner for my ghoul slugs. Was there a problem with the shipment? Oh, no problem. Except me almost getting killed. I don't never want to go back there again, Dr. Black. That place is... it's unnatural. Oh, where do I find these people? Take it inside. Let's test the potency, shall we? Another fine batch. I'm beginning to think our possibilities for ghouling may be endless. So, I hope you all feel secure knowing the quality, care, and darn it, love that goes into every mecha beast we build. That's it? Aren't you gonna show us the final assembly area? Uh, closed for remodeling. I can show you kids the commissary, all the Cape Berry shakes you can drink. <laughs> well, if you are challenging Frontal to break his personal shake drinking record, I accept. There's something about this guy. I don't trust him. Bah! Anyone who offers delicious shakes is a friend to me. So what exactly happened to Grendel? He loved this job. You kids ask a lot of questions, don't you? Oh, what's down there? Just spare parts. Hey, who wants those shakes? Whoa, me, 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 me! Come on, Pronto. I want to check this out. Oh, but, but the shakes! Hey, what are you doing here? Quickly, this way! If there's one thing Proto is good at, it is escaping danger! Especially when it's escaping into something worse! Goodbye, my friend. My thoughts exactly, Burpee. What, what are you doing? Fighting fire with fire. Backdraft! Alpha G recording. Initiating auto ghouling sequence. They're ghouling the mecha beast. Black's behind this. Oh, yeah. Welcome to the future of ghouling. Too bad you won't be around to enjoy it. <laughs> Here's the commissary and all the cave berry shakes you can drink. Wait, 
Where are the other two? Attention! We have intruders on level eight! You're not really an engineer, are you? Don't try anything clever. Clever? <laughs> not to worry there. My partner here doesn't know the meaning of the word. <gasps> I should have known my scout would lead me into a pickle like this. You forget yourself, sir. In fact, I don't think this mole could find his butt with both hands. First, fully, I do know where my butt is. Second, Divly, it would behoove you to choose your next words carefully. A molenoid can be pushed only so far. It gets worse the more you scratch. <clears throat> I suggest that we run away as calmly as possible. You are quite an actor, Eli. <laughs> this way! <laughs> Listen, do you smell that? No. Well, that's because you can't hear with your nose like I can. It's coming from that way. Cleaning supplies. Yeesh, spoiled meat storage. Axle grease. And, ah, oh, yes. I think you may find something of great importance behind that door, my sniffleless friend. Nice work, Pronto. Ha -ha! You just had to barge in here asking your nosy questions. Why couldn't you have just crashed and burned like everyone else is going to? You're working for Black, aren't you? Very good. Then you've probably also figured out that Dr. Black doesn't like to leave any loose ends. And that's exactly what you two are. A loose end. Tour's over! <laughs> It's just in time, buddy boy. <laughs> That's not all I found. Look who was locked up in the basement. Grendel? Boy, am I glad to see you. No time for hugs and howdy-do's, youngster. We gotta move fast before they send those mecha beasts out to all of Slug Terra. Grendel's right. We gotta hustle. Oh, <laughs> you're much too late for that. <laughs> Grendel, can you guys buy us some time? They'd like nothing better. You, with me. Okay, okay, what's going on in this place? Darius has ghouled the Mecha Beasts. What? How can you ghoul a machine? That's the energy inside the heart unit that they get at. I've seen them do it. Uh, so what's gonna happen to our mechas? First, they start acting funny. Then they go totally bonkers. Then, boom! Those creeps made me look like a fool. Worse, they made me look like a bad mechanic. Yeah, then there's the whole exploding thing. They're going to send those upgrades out to everyone. No, they're not. We're going to shut this place down. But first, we're going to save our mechas. It breaks my heart, Fernando. But I must leave you to your explosive fate. Maybe not, Pronto. What do you think, Doc? I need cover! <laughs> My slugs aren't even scratching that thing! Whoa. Uh. 
<laughs> it's good to be little. We've got to even the odds. Easy, Bella. Easy, boy. <laughs> you did it! Can you do it again? Easy, Boomer. your mecha beast. Good for you. This doesn't change a thing. In the end, Dr. Black cannot be stopped. You're gonna feel pretty embarrassed when we prove you wrong. Spend the time! Rosco will save you! <laughs> what a pile of junk. This wee man. Now then, you were saying? Oh, Fernando! I, I thought you were cured! Oh, no. Everybody run! Before he explodes! Uh, actually, that one was me. I was saving it for a special occasion. Oh, you and your wonderful pranks! Oh, I could kiss you! I could kiss you! I mean, perhaps another time. Doc, you did a really great job out there. Thanks for saving our rides. Oh, yeah! Oh, yeah! Oh, yeah! <sighs> That's the last one. Nice work, Doc. Once this story gets out, people are gonna start to realize the truth about Dr. Black. I'm just glad to see Slug Terra has a Shane once again. Oh, it was Proto's pleasure to save the day. <laughs> One more stink blast for fun. Save it for the ride home. Done and done. What if Black tries again? My engineers are already on it. Black may have a new trick, but I can promise you it will never find its way inside one of our mechas. It seems our improvements to the mecha beasts have been discovered. Disappointing. We'll just have to try a little harder next time, won't we? That's the spirit. They can enjoy this victory, but I'm a patient man. Very patient. Increase our production. I'm going to be needing more ghouls. A lot more ghouls. There it is. Deadweed Cavern. I dare you to go near it. Yeah, sure, it's a little creepy looking, but what's the big deal? We're passing by. Hold your breath or the evil spirits will get in your nose. <gasps> ah, a foolish superstition. Pronto holds his breath for nothing. 
Uh, well, uh, maybe to be safe. <laughs> you guys cracked me up. I'm going in for a closer look. <laughs> Eli, don't be a fool! Isn't Deadweed where Fright Geist slugs come from? Let's go see if we can get some. Come on, guys. Where's your sense of adventure? This is a place of unspeakable danger. Only thing you'll find in there is... Ooh. Sick owls? Oh, for the love of... Eli, you're talking about ghosts. Well, I'm not afraid of ghosts. Because they don't exist. <laughs> We'll be in and out before you know it. Fine, you wait here. I'll be back in one minute. <laughs> Eli! <laughs> Eli? I don't like this. Eli? Where are you, buddy? <laughs> you should have seen the look on your faces. <laughs> Very funny. And now who's the Joker? That wasn't us. It's stuck! We're trapped! Maybe this wasn't such a good idea after all. We should have waited by the door. It could be half past forever by the time someone rescues us. We'll see if we can find another way out. And film some ghosts. I'd settle for some people. What happened to them all? It used to be a busy gold mine. Then, years ago, abandoned. Many ventured into Siwai, only to emerge screaming in fear. Or worse, never seen again. This is great. We can find a new slug and solve a mystery. Either way, it's gonna make some great footage. Of our gruesome demise! Just make me look heroic when the hungry ghosts come to eat my molinoid brains. Did you say brains? Yes, of course. We molinoids have two brains, which makes me twice as scared and twice as tasty. <laughs> Pronto, it's just a shovel. <laughs> ah, the fog is too thick. I can't see anything. We should turn back while well, we still have our brains. Nobody wants to eat your brains, Pronto. Hey, what's wrong with my brains? I got something that'll cut through this fog. Sonar scope. All clear. Oh yeah, this baby works like a charm. <laughs> Are you sure that thing's working? Is, uh, sorry, I put it on backwards. That's it! I'm leading us to an exit! Come I... on, this is fun. It's like Halloween. What's a Halloween? It's, uh, an old chain tradition. Uh, once a year we dress up in scary costumes and get candy from the neighbors. Sounds like extortion. Wow, Pronto. I've never seen you so scared. Pronto is not scared. Pronto is, uh... Terrified. Uh, I could be wrong, but that sounded like a voice. Or a sick owl. It was saying, turn back. It's the wind. Last time I checked, the wind doesn't say, turn back. Yeah, I guess you're right. 
Hey, Pronto, look, another brain-eating ghost. Ha ha! Very funny, Mr. Cape Troll Man. Turn back! <laughs> Ghosts? I told you so! I don't think they want to be friends. Let them have it, guys! <laughs> I wouldn't believe it if I didn't see it with my own eyes. Well, at least we lost them. Why did they leave? Wait! They're coming back! No, listen. This is something else. What is this place? The Slug Terrain Express. What's it doing way down here? Dead, we never had a stop. This is new. Like, really new. Is that who I think it is? Dr. Black's most feared enforcer, El Diabolos Nacho. Put your suits on and get to work. What is going on down here? They're back. <laughs> Turn back. <laughs> My answer is still no. Is that a Fright Guy slug? It used to be. That one's been ghouled. Now it's a Night Guy <laughs> It turns you into a quivering coward until the effects wear off. How did his slugs hit when ours went right through? Well, maybe because the slugs were ghouled. Who knows what happens when Black changes them? Did you hear the ghosts? They told him to turn back too. Turn back from what? All right, men, we're going in. Open the doors! I need to know what these guys are up to. <laughs> right with you, bro. It would be safer to stay here, or uh, run as fast as we can in the opposite direction. Uh, that way. Okay, why does no one ever listen to Pronto? <laughs> Too late. We're gonna have to get into that control room. Leave that to me. Trick or treat! Huh? What's the password? Uh, ouch. Um, yep, that worked. Look for anything unusual, and see if you can find a switch to open that tunnel door. Take a look at this guy. What's unusual about a miner? He's one of the ghosts we fought earlier. It's the same guy. See, he was once alive, now he's a ghost. Case closed! What if the miners of Deadweed didn't leave? They said turn back. 
Maybe it was a warning to us to get out of here before whatever happened to them happens to us. <laughs> Very good advice. I suggest we follow it. Not until we figure out what Black is taking from this place. <laughs> Nice work, Pronto. Guys, check it out. They got a full-blown mining operation going on here. What is that stuff? You don't bust out the safety suits for just anything. They're handling something dangerous here. Dark water. You know what that is? I think so, yeah. And it ain't good. The old trolls used to call it Karum Zanul. Means dark water. Our home cavern was about as deep as this one. Sometimes a little bit of that stuff would seep up through the cracks. Strange things would happen around it. Unnatural things. So what do they want with dark water? Guys. This is how Black changes regular slugs into ghouls. He uses dark water. With a well like that, Black could turn every slug in Slug Terra evil. If we cut off Black's supply of dark water, we stop him from ghouling slugs. We need to take out that well. <laughs> Burpee's in. So am I. Me too. No, thank you. Come on, Pronto. Don't you come on, Pronto, Pronto. I refuse to let anything unnatural happen to me! You can't leave. You could do anything if you butcher my might do it. You're right. The odds are not in our favor. And yeah, you're afraid of ghosts. But I know something you're not afraid of. You're not afraid to do the right thing. Especially if it means fame and glory. Oh yes. The glory. All right. Pronto is in. What? We cannot attack. There is... A better way. This isn't gonna work. Yes, it will. I don't see Nacho around, and everybody's busy doing their thing. You said that strange things would happen around this stuff. Like, what kinds of things? It was sort of like... Uh, the life was sucked right out of you. No wonder they have protective suits. The miners aren't ghosts. They just got exposed to the dark water. How do we shut this off? I say we just blow it up. And flood the cavern? And no thanks. We're just gonna have to get up to the pump and shut it down manually. Right. But how do we handle the guards? Ah, please! All this requires is a little persuasive yeah. charisma. <laughs> hey! Get out of my way, you ugly pigs! Smooth. You heard him! Move it, ugly pigs! We have a potential leak here. Look what happened to this guy. Hey! Unless you want to go for a swim, get back to the train. <laughs> See? What's our ever any down? All right, let's shut her down. I don't know, man. Easier said than done. It's not like there's an on-off switch. Load up another car. Move, move! Think, troll. Think. Think faster! They're going to realize that we're up to something eventually! <laughs> Quit standing around! We've got intruders! <laughs> I'll hold them off. You guys figure out how to shut this thing down for good. Eli 
I just got hit by a night geist! <laughs> it's after me! Make it stop! <laughs> This will flush them out! That's right! You better run back to your mother and tell her that Pronto sent you! <laughs> That thing scared the snot out of me. We gotta get back to the team. Huh? <sighs> the effects of that ghouled fright guy slug are still playing on my nerves. I don't like the sounds of that burpee. <laughs> Whoa! You must be a Fright Guy slug! Uh, that's quite the trick you just pulled. I could use a guy like you on my team. Whoa! Wait! Uh, wait! We're on the same side! This started happening to you after Black dug that well, didn't it? All this time, you were just warning people to stay away so the same thing wouldn't happen to them. My friends and I are trying to put an end to all this. Will you help us fight? We need to find another way to shut this place down. We're completely on top of Where is Eli? Where are you, Eli Shane? Bring the heat, Burpee! Firewall! <laughs> you wanna fight, Nacho? Well, come and find me! <laughs> you do not frighten me. No? Well, I can change that. <laughs> Take us out of here! No! Stop that train! That slug took out the control room, and that took out all the fail safes! This thing's gonna blow! We need to put that fight! <laughs> You're perfect! Of course I am! Wait, let me go on. <laughs> Once again, Pronto saves the day! All right, guys, that should do it. This well sealed up for good. And we'll make sure it stays that way. Hey, look. The effects. They're wearing off. Yeah! Woohoo! <laughs> there, you see? What did I tell you? There's no such thing as ghost. What happened here? Well, it's a long story, but this place used to be a gold mine. Then Black Industries bought the company, and the business changed. Black made us dig the well. Had no idea what it was for until it was too late. Oh. 
we've been trying to stop them. But with those ghoul slugs, and in our weakened state, we were just no match. If it weren't for you, I'm not sure what would have become of us. But what brought you here anyway? Somebody wanted to go on a slug hunt. For what? One of these? <laughs> oh, take it. We can all have one. Thanks, but I already have one of my own. What's wrong, Eli? This wasn't exactly a victory. Black's men got away with a ton of dark water. Who knows how much he's already stockpiled. And if he somehow made a deal with whatever is down in the deep caverns, no telling what else he could do. With all these fandango slugs. Huh. I know they have tons of slug energy, but aren't they pretty useless in a fight? That slug energy is precisely why we need them. They aren't for dueling. We're taking them to Bullseye Cavern. Something is forcing the native slugs to abandon the place, turning it into a dead zone. We need an infusion of fandango slug energy to attract the native slugs back. Oh, so you're hoping the fandangos will jumpstart the cavern and bring it back to life? Every time we try to deliver the slugs, those two shut us down. Lock and load. They work for Dr. Black. They've blown up nearly every passage in and out of Bullseye from the west. And now our mechas are trashed. We'll never get the slugs there in time. We'll take them for you. We will! Oh, ah, uh, yes! We will! So it's true. You really are Will Shane's kid. Well, we need a Shane right now. Bullseye doesn't get these slugs by the end of the day. We'll lose it for good. Huh, no pressure. <sighs> You're a good kid, Eli Shane. Well, let's load them up. What? The Shane gang's taking the load to Bullseye? Uh, that's not good, is it? Do you think we should call the boss? Did you get knocked in the head again? Not a word to black about this. If he finds out, he'll send reinforcements. This is our job. We'll take care of them ourselves and collect us a huge reward. reward. Just think of what we could do with all that money, Load. We could buy us a lot of gold. Oh, oh. 
Okay, break it down for me again. The caverns run on slug energy. Didn't you learn this in school like the rest of us? Must have been homesick that day. Right. Well, the energy that makes all life possible here is strongest in the slugs. Wherever they are, things live. Without them... Got it. Dead zone. I just don't get why Black would want to let that happen to an entire cavern. They're trying to box us in. Pronto, lead us back out! I believe they have accomplished their diabolical goal. I curse their success! This way! It's our only chance! <laughs> <laughs> we done crush them chains. We yeah, have little brother. Best we get down there and make sure. They're a crafty bunch. <sighs> well, that was fun. And when I say fun, I mean oh, oh, my head. We're alive? That's good, right? Pronto. Where are we? Hmm. Let me see. Hmm. Let's see. <clears throat> Oh! <laughs> ah, yes. Here we go. We are completely cut off from our destination. Uh, would you like me to be more specific? Is there another path? Nope. A uh, secret passage? Nope. Anything? Well, uh, no. Ah, uh, I heard a well. What is it, Pronto? Well, uh, maybe there is a route we could take, but we'd be fools to do so. Usually when you say things like that, it ends up being fun. Oh, no, 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 no. Not this time. The only other way to Bullseye is a path fraught with peril. It's dark, long, twisting, and cuts right through the territory of the Shadow Clan. Guys? No, no, no. You're not actually considering. You are. Oh, we didn't get them all blown up. Told you they were crafty. Well, if they're so crafty, why are they going that way? That's Shadow Clan territory. Uh, we can follow? I'd rather face black than what's down that passage. They'll never make it through. But we should be prepared, just in case. The Dark Periphery. Home of the Shadow Clan. This is the opportunity of a lifetime. I mean, no one has ever managed to capture the Shadow Clan on film. At least, no one who's managed to live. You're unusually quiet, Pronto. Pronto is not quiet. Pronto is speechless. The most evil things in all of Slagterra, and we are strolling into their backyard. I've seen them before, remember? They're scary, sure, but they can't be that bad. Maybe they're just misunderstood. What? What? You said it yourself. We're only just skirting through the edge of their territory. They probably won't even know we're here. Ah, I hear something. Everyone, against the rock! Is this really necessary? Shh. Okay, yes it is. Nobody move! This Shadow Clan have excellent vision, a keen sense of smell, and a pension for scary Molinoids to their early deaths. I don't see them. We were lucky. Let's count our blessings and uh, uh, turn back. We can't turn back. Bullseye needs those slugs. Oh, fine. The sooner we're there, the sooner we're out of this wretched place. My dad used to tell me about the Shadow Clan, how they can talk to slugs, and how they've been here forever. Uh, guys, I don't want to freak you out, but there's something moving behind us. I thought we lost them. I know several Molinoid tracking tricks that should confuse them. Hmm, dry rock. No tracks for them to follow. And... 
Ah, we are downwind, so no scent for them to pick up. Follow my lead. How fortunate you are to be in the company of the best tracker in Slack Terra. <laughs> Guys, we gotta step on it. What? Preposterous! Uh, okay, uh, time for another incredible mononoid skill. <laughs> Escape! <laughs> They're on our six! <laughs> You see? My evasive tactics were a grand success. But Prince for Pronto can wait until we get to Bullseye. If I never see the Shadow Clan again, it will be too soon. Uh, guys? There's more of them. We should get a closer look. What? Are you kidding? You're not kidding. You know what? You should get more. Okay, you got your closer look. We better scram. Look, the path ahead is too exposed. If we move now, everyone down there is gonna see us. We need some kind of distraction. I don't like the looks of this. I'm right there with you. They're distracted. This is our chance. Miserable creatures, you'll give us away! Guys, what's gotten into you? It's like a big giant sign pointing right at us! And I am the only you can eat buffet! Pronto, you and Trixie keep going with those slugs. Gordon and I will buy some time. This is to be my fate. Pronto will go out in a blaze of... But surrender! Look on the bright side. No one's ever been this close to the Shadow Clan. <laughs> Just checking the lens cap. <gasps> Sorry we had to cross through your territory, but we have a good reason. If we don't get these slugs to Bullseye Cavern, then the cavern will go dark. It'll die. Hey! Those aren't yours! Do you understand me at all? Bullseye Cavern needs these slugs. I think they're letting us go. Lucky for them. Thank you. Burpee, what did you say to them? Huh? Well, whatever it was, good job. Okay, Bullseye Gathered. 
You may now begin singing my praises. Now what? Release the Fandangos. They'll find somewhere to roost, and then this will all be over. Here you go, little fellas. Don't be shy. not supposed to happen, is it? They definitely don't like something in here. Maybe we're too late. Where are you guys going? <laughs> Stay with me, Burpee. Keep your slugs close. Whatever this is, it's affecting them, too. <laughs> <laughs> Knee path to Bullseye Cavern. <laughs> we blowed it up good. <laughs> Saint Gang, they made it. <laughs> it don't matter. They're too late. The cavern's dead. Their slugs are bugging out. I'll be with you guys in a second. We can still save this cavern. Pronto, I need you to round up the Fandango slugs. It would be my pleasure. Trixie, maybe you can figure out what's making them leave? On it. Cord, say no more. Now. I think it's time we settled this. You two want to do us. Unless you want to hug it out instead. <laughs> you can't win! <laughs> and not only that, you're gonna lose! So, that's the way it's going to be, huh? I know you don't like it here, Jules, but please stick around, okay? Run all you want! Run to kill! We do this all day! You're only tiring yourself out! What exactly am I looking for? The Fandango slugs! How did you do that? Ah, curse you beasts! I know you want to get out of here, but I have an idea and I need your help. <laughs> Hope this works. You don't like going this way, do you? Bullseye! Whoa! So that explains it! I've got to get Eli! <laughs> I'm almost out of slugs. Me too. And if they get chased away with the rest of them, we'll have an even bigger problem. No slugs at all. <laughs> Minute, kid. You lost. Yeah, and we won. So then, why are they smiling? I'll give you a hint. <laughs> Nice try! Fright guy slug. Nice shot, Trixie. Thanks. Our trip to Deadweed has really paid off. You're gonna wanna see this. Dark water? Yep. This is what was driving the slugs away. Black thought he could ghoul this entire cavern. And I've got just the cure. That's a lot of dark water. You sure Doc can neutralize it all? What do you think, Doc? Up for a swim? Hey! Ah, ah! 
Running out of steam. Yaha! Success! Uh, only one? No, it's perfect. Fire it into the hole. The good energy in it will help counteract the dark kind. Pronto, hurry! <laughs> Why of all caverns did Black want to empty out this place? Because this is the exact center of Slug Terra. Get it? Bullseye. This was nothing but a land grab, and Black was staking his claim with dark water. Uh, looks like we figured everything out. Not everything. I can't stop thinking about why the Shadow Clan let us go. Sure wish you could tell us what you know about him. I did it! I'm the first person to ever capture the Shadow Clan on film! Uh, congratulations? I know. Isn't it great? When this footage gets out, it's gonna be massive! All right. We'll lay low for a while, then find a way to get back to that kid and his gang. Yeah, I'll get them good. Make Black help in. Make us happy. We send a message. No one messes with lock and load. Not happy. <clears throat> Point of order, Your Honor. I beg the court's indulgence to plead for my, uh, not guiltiness. It was a simple misunderstanding, really. <laughs> Spitting on the sidewalk is illegal in this town. Judge Logan has us enforce the law with no exceptions. It's just God! In conclusion, I throw myself on the mercy of the court. Oh, please, Your Honor. Pretty, 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 please, with the <laughs> chocolate sauce on it. Guilty. <laughs> well, he did actually do it. So let's just pay the fine and get out of here. Fifty years hard labor. <laughs> Fifty years? No, <laughs> oh, it's all my fault. I had to do something to stop him from stealing my gum. I thought it would teach him a lesson. Your Honor, you can't be serious. Fifty years for spitting on the sidewalk? Look, I'm Eli Shane, and I want to see justice done, too. But this is... A Shane, huh? Never much cared for the Shanes. But in your case, I'll make an exception. And not put you away for aggravated sass! Lock him up! Wait! This is a travesty of justice! I've got my eye on you. Trixie, Cord, we need to poke around this jail and see what it's made of. Why? Because we're gonna bust Pronto out. <laughs> Some kind of criminal mastermind? Uh, 
Uh, why, yes. Uh, yes, indeed. I am the head of a vast organization, infamous for its villainy and sharp attire. Uh, I thought you were pinched for spitting gum. Uh, true, but that was the least of my crimes. Uh, what are you in for? Public speaking. He's in for breathing too loud, and they locked him up for aggravated smiling. Yeah, that Judge Logan has a real racket going. He, he locks you up for breaking ridiculous laws and then sells you off for hard labor. And not just any hard labor. I hear they send you to work for Dr. Black. <gasps> Dr. Black? That's what my source tells me. <laughs> Judge Logan clears out his jails and Black gets free workers for his smelters. Well, how long do we have? Few days, maybe. Then we need to move fast. Now let's go over the plan. This delivers supplies to the jail every day. Paid the driver to take his place. If we pull this off, we'll cut away everyone undetected. Good. Remember, guys, Pronto isn't the only one in there who's been unjustly locked up. There are other prisoners in there that need our help. Then we can put a stop to that judge. Now, tell me about the shot I've got to make. It's pretty close to impossible, so I get you this. Pretty awesome. Yeah, that SVX 5000 scope gives you every angle, every reading, every trajectory to make amazing shots. And I mail ordered this speed stinger slug to go with the scope. He's the only slug that can make it work, because all the scope's data and angles are put right into his little high-tech goggles. Hi, stunts. Welcome to the team. Now, let's go over the plan. First, Cord will drive up to the jail and act casual, like he's delivering supplies. Trixie will make sure the guard is distracted and give me the sign. Then it's all up to me and the speed stinger. And if everything goes according to plan, we hit velocity, ricochet off the wagon, rebound off the flagpole, make its way to the cooling tower, make a series of bank shots to the jail roof. Go in through the air vent, make a bank shot, a quick roll, spring the lock, into the cage, open the cuffs, and with the coast clear, get everyone to safety without anyone being the wiser. Okay, guys, let's go spring pronto. Just trust the high-tech stuff, right? This is a little confusing. I hope you're getting all these stunts. Oh no. Oh man. Whoa. Not good. That was a complete and total disaster. What did we tell you, Eli? The one weak spot in your plan is that nobody can make that shot. Yeah, nobody. Well, except maybe Mario Bravado. Mario who? What? Oh, come on. Mario Bravado? Only the greatest trick shot slinger ever. Here. Check it out. He could make any shot. Yeah, had his own show and everything. What happened to him? Apparently he dropped out of the spotlight and now owns a restaurant out in the middle of nowhere. Well, I think it's time Mario Bravado made a comeback, and fast. This can't be the right place. Why would a trick shot legend live here? Hey, welcome to Ricochet Pizza. We sling the best pies at Slug Terra. What can I get you? Are you Mario Bravado? No, I'm Mario the pizza guy. Look, I think I know who you are, and I've been told that only Mario Bravado can make the trick shot I need. Sorry, that Mario's retired. The only things I sling now are pizza pies. So if you want to keep talking, order something. See, a friend of mine has... Uh, uh, uh. No pizza, no talking. Oh, okay. I'll have the... Super Slinger Super Cheese. Order up! One Super Super Cheese! All right, 
Let me tell you about the shot I need from you. See, a friend of mine, I already told you, I'm retired. I'll never, ever, ever fire a slug again. This is a matter of life and death. Judge Logan has been selling prisoners to Dr. Black and... What you really need help with is your hearing. I said no. <laughs> that went well. So I'm surrounded by fire scorpions, but they realize I am the toughest molinoid they've ever seen. <laughs> then what happened? <laughs> One simple nod, and the entire pack scurries away in fear. That's why my organization will bust me out of here. You see, it's about fear and the respect. Kind of a fearful respect. The Molinoid is trouble. Especially with a Shane in his corner. Sooner we have them out of here, the better. See what you can do. <sighs> Listen, I... I said no! Now scram! I'm just here to, uh, eat. Uh, uh, can't believe I ate that much pizza. Look, my friend is in real trouble. This isn't for me, it's for him. They tell me you're the only one who can make the shot I need. That's all? Sounds like more trouble than it's worth, kid. Forget it. I'm done slinging. Forever. What happened to you? Excuse me? You were some big hero, then you just disappeared. Uh, I'm no hero. I was a kid with a TV show, that's all. I know a little bit about being famous, you know. My dad was Will Shane. What? Really? Well, you could have mentioned that. Would it have changed your mind? Nope. All right, then. Sorry I wasted your time and mine. Wait, I'm not gonna take the shot. But if it's that important, I'll teach you how to do it. Should be no problem for a Shane. I hope you're a good teacher, because I don't have a lot of time. Okay, that's three large, no onion. Thanks for calling ricochets. Okay, remember, 90% of trick shooting is half mental. So first things first, we make the pizza. Uh, what? Uh, if it helps my friend, I'll try anything. Uh, what do you think you're doing? Uh, making pizza? Relax, we'll get to that. First things first, figure out the order, the layers. Plan it out in your head. Can you guess what I'm looking at right now? The ingredients. Uh, wrong. I'm looking at the finished pizza in my head. When you start something, always know what it is you're wanting to finish. In this case, we're making what? Three large pizzas, the works. It's about lining up all the ingredients together. You wanna see why this place is called Ricochet Pizza? They said no onion. Good, you're paying attention. Now make three large pizzas, the works. No onion. We need to make the whole pizza in one shot. Ricochet pizza, remember? Right. that again. High-tech stuff just doesn't get it done like finely honed instincts. You got them. You just have to trust them. Okay, so now do we do some slinging? If you mean slinging more pizzas, yes. Okay, hit this with pepperoni without looking. How was that? Uh, I think 
think you need a little more honing. You're improving, Eli, but you gotta relax. Okay, when do I learn to shoot? That's what you've been doing. You just don't know it yet. You've got a trick shooter's heart, Eli, and I've never seen anyone so connected with their slugs, other than me. So why did you quit? I haven't told anyone this, you know. I was at the top of my game. Felt like nothing could go wrong. I guess I was a little too cocky. One day I was offered a job, and I refused. Probably said a few things I shouldn't have. I got called out. If I lost, I'd have to quit forever. I thought I couldn't be beat. I was wrong. I got hit by a slug I had never seen before. Never want to see it again. It was a ghoul, wasn't it? You duel black. Doesn't matter. I'm a man of my word, and I told you I'd train you. So, have you and Stunts figured it out? And even though you forgot to add extra cheese, I think you're ready. You know Dr. Black is a cheat. He'd never hold up his end of the bargain. You don't owe him anything. This world needs you. So do I. Okay, we're in. Really? Great. But you're making the shot. Good news. I got trained up, and I brought Mario Bravado to back me up. Hey, yeah, look at you. Wow, you're really Mario Bravado. Do you remember the episode of your show, number 56, where you shot that slug right... Cord, we don't have time for this. Nice to meet you, Mario. Love the jacket. We got some bad news, Eli. They're leaving. Now. <sighs> For a trick shot to break him out of jail. You can do it, kid. Put all your ingredients together. It's just as easy as making a pizza. What have they been doing? Guys, we need to get a move on. It's been a while, hasn't it, friend? You're gonna sling? You're not afraid of black. I don't have to be either. It's time to come out of retirement. But you're still making the shot. Right. Cord, catch that train. <laughs> Gang? Step on it! There they are! Ha -ha! They've come for me! Hey, who's that other guy? Hey, this Bob Pronto's the real deal. He's got Mario Bravado in his gang. Well, of course! I taught Mario Bravado everything he knows! Mario who? Hey, Eli! We got trouble up ahead! Once the express goes in that tunnel, we won't be able to follow. It'll be too late. Talk about a trick shot. Take out the guards, free Pronto, and try to stay on this wagon. Gord, you focus on driving. Trixie, we'll need you as a spotter. <laughs> Don't get cocky, kid. That tunnel's getting closer fast! Yeah, I think they just picked up speed. I got four more guards and we still have to get the prisoners loose. Here we go, kid. Sling it like you mean it. No! 
are we gonna get them off the train one by one? We don't have time! Hey, the pin that locks Pronto's car into the train! That's our only hope! I can't take out the pin and the switch in one shot! That's impossible! No, it's not! Just remember what I taught you! Find the ingredients, the layers, plan it out! <laughs> Okay, stunts. Let's do this. It, kid. Mm. All this talk of pizza has given Pronto a powerful hunger for the extra cheese. Ah, it was hard on the inside, let me tell you. And the food pff, was atrocious. Pronto, you were barely in jail two days. And yet, I survived. You can still make the best trick shots. If you're ever ready to make a comeback for real, you've got a spot on our team. Thanks. But I think I'll stick to slinging pizzas, for now. But someday, hey, who knows? <laughs> it's great we got Pronto out, but what are we gonna do about Judge Logan? Give him a taste of his own medicine. illegal in these parts. Oh, no, wait. I was sprayed. That gum was awful, like hot sauce and rotten fish. We enforce the law with no exceptions. Your orders, sir. What? Wait! <laughs> 